what are the other areas where LDN is just captivating the world? Now, I've had some wacky, really wacky patient responses. He is dysarthric. He can't speak. He's got weakness. He has hemibody pain, burning pain. This is that central yeah. pain. Okay. Thalamic pain. So he comes to me several years later, can barely speak at all. He's tried everything. Uh, you know, let's try low dose naltrexone. Goes away, he comes back a couple months later. Pain has improved. But not only that, he's now speaking and throwing a few words together for the first time in like since his stroke. I'm like, what the hell? I bump up his dose. You cannot hurt yourself on this drug. He comes back a few months later. He's now like talking in sentences. I said, are you sure this isn't due to your speech therapist? And they swear up and down. Absolutely not. I go up to 13 and a half and now he's having conversations. And how's his pain? Massively better. What is the downside of this? I am hard pressed to come up with significant risks. We have decades and decades and decades of experience with this drug in people with addiction. You can probably find it in your local area at other compounding pharmacies. It usually runs about $30 a month. So it's basically a free drug. It's one that I use more and more and more because of its safety profile and its potential for getting me a home run. 